This is Jason. Yeah, hi, Jason. Uh, this is Alan Armstrong. Hey, I got calling you about that dog from earlier, and I just wondered if now would be a good time to talk about that. What dog? I was at the <laughs> warehouse earlier, and the dog, the dog that you had bit me if I on the arm, I just got out of the, the got, got six stitches there. Um, uh, I'm not aware, I'm, yes, I'm an employee of the warehouse, I'm not aware of this situation, sorry. Um, I was, I was walking through there, and then, Employee had a dog, and I said, "Oh, that's a nice dog." I put him, and he said, "Yeah, sure." And he bit me on the arm, and I asked for your information. You gave me your name and your number. Yeah. Um, um. Hold on. Let me get my pen. Let me get pen and paper here. Hold on a second. Um. My arm really hurts. You know, can't even use it. Okay. Um. I tried to try to use a ketchup bottle, and it broke. I had to use my other arm. My wife, she opened the fridge and hit herself in the head because I couldn't even do the microwave when I was trying to use a microwave. The toilet wasn't even clean. Okay. Uh, what person's warehouse were you at? I I don't remember the one. The, 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 do you know where the Main Street is? Uh. Yeah. Well, no. It's so. If you take, if you go down from Main Street, you go down about four miles. Let me see. One mile south of uh, where I live, and then you turn east, and so it's right there next to the, uh, there's, a, there's a stoplight there on the corner, and so it's not too far from there. Okay. Um, I was driving around, I don't remember, they like, gave me a sedative after I got bit. Okay. And I, uh, but right, I just so, don't know, are you going to put oh, what's your name? My name's Alan, A-L-L-E-N, Armstrong. Armstrong, Okay. And, you know, you bit, bit, bit my, bit my arm. Uh, are you gonna have the dog put down? What are, what are your plans as far as the dog goes? Um, I, I don't know. Sorry. I'm, I'm with the corporate for it. So I've, I've, do you well, happen to know what the employee's name was, uh, that the dog owner was? Uh, the, you know, well, I have the piece, I have the piece of paper here. Let me see if I can pull it out. Jason. Yeah, that's me. So. I'm, uh, yeah, yeah. I work. For, I work for corporate, but I'm trying yeah, to figure out what yeah, location is that. Who is the owner of the dog? Said his name, and I spoke with says his name was Jason, and he apologized that his dog bit me. Oh, you so know, I'm Jason. I'm a corporate said, employee. I don't work at one of the locations. He said either either the company insurance will pay. Or I'll pay out of my own pocket if they don't. Pay. Okay, so I'm whoever gave you my name. So I work for a corporate <laughs> warehouse. Who I'm trying to find out if it was an employee's dog that bit you, in what location they were at. Well, why did you, you your dog usually go around biting people? It's not my dog, sir. I wasn't at that. Are you just walking them for fun? Um. Sorry, I, I don't know where you're going with this. Well, I just want somebody to take care of my own. Okay, that's that's fine. So what I need to get from you is, your name's Alan Armstrong, what location were you at? I cannot help you unless you tell me what location you were at. Yeah, you know, like I said, you know, location was, so, okay, the location is right between my elbow and my wrist in the middle of no, my arm. No, I'm talking what <laughs> warehouse you were at. It's the one where they they sell the sports equipment. Okay. And they, I know that I was looking at. I was well. I was going in there to get a football for my grandson. Okay. So I, here's the deal. What I need you to do is write down my email address and then email me all the information. Don't even, I don't even have your email address. Not quite address, sir. right now. I don't have your email address. How am I supposed to write uh, it down? I can give it to you. You can write it down. Well, I don't have a computer nearby. Okay, well, you can still write down my email address. You can email me the location you were at, the time, so I can follow up with the manager at the location and understand it. Okay, but, okay, so why don't I just go to Sportsman's Warehouse and write the email there? Sorry, can you repeat yourself? I could go to the Sportsman's Warehouse and write the email there, and that way it'll get to you quicker. Um, sure, I guess. Okay, what's your, what, 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 what's the street address to that? City is your email address then. Okay, you're you're not making uh, much sense right now. Well, yeah, so what I need to do is I can you're call you back you're tomorrow. You're the one asking me to write down your email address, and I don't even have it. You're the, your dog bit me. I didn't bite your dog. Okay, I wasn't at a location today, and I do not have a 
a dog that I have over at uh, whatever location. You can't even tell me what location you're at, so I'm trying to so figure out what, first what that is. Name? Somebody gave you my name and phone number for the location that you're at. Well, what's your dog's name? Uh, I don't have a dog. Uh, that's why. You already told me earlier you did when you wrote down your name after it bit me. Okay, I don't. I didn't write down a name or number, so I don't work at a location. I work at the corporate office, not at a physical location. That doesn't even make sense because I wasn't even at no stinking corporate office today. I'm I'm well aware of that, sir. So what I need How to do? Did you know? How did you know huh? I wasn't there? You follow? Are you following me? How did you know I wasn't at a corporate office today? I, did you? We don't you, allow the outside, we don't we don't allow outside public in our corporate office. Well, how am I supposed to send you an email then? Um, do me a favor. I'm going to give you a phone call tomorrow. I have your phone number right now, and we can you, hopefully. Did, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Okay, I just got to find out what location you're at. How did you get my phone number? You you my phone number? I didn't give. I did not give you my phone number. How did you get it? So it must have been you, because I gave it. I gave you my phone number earlier today. So that's how. You're, so you took you're you're my phone number. So obviously that was you. I caught you. I caught you right in the hand. I caught you red-handed. I'm too smart for you, pal.